<laughs> no, no. Is, There's is like, literally no car here. The car hit them and drove away. Multiple witnesses frantically on the phone with Guilford County emergency crews. Get big and hit by a car. So yeah, it's, a they, so they, it's a pedestrian hit by a car? Hoping they could do anything to help Katrina Calls, who was seriously hurt. They're, they're not responding, just a moment. they're moving slightly. Police believe the 57-year-old was hit while walking along Westgate City Boulevard Tuesday night. She was just a few feet from turning down Warren Street, less than 200 yards from her house. She mean? walks, she catches the bus. I mean, you see her normally when she out here with her dogs, you know. It's just, oh my goodness. Anita Thompson has been calls neighbor for the past two years. The blue and white police lights woke her up Tuesday night, but she didn't know it was her neighbor who was hit until Wednesday morning. I didn't know until you came and knocked on the door. I knew there was an accident up there or whatever when I left to go to work this morning, but I didn't know it was her. Anita in absolute disbelief to learn what happened to her friend. She saw calls just a few hours earlier as she walked to this bus stop at the end of a road. From her coming home that time of night, I could only think of her being out ringing the bell with Salvation Army. She's glad people stopped to help her neighbor, even if the driver didn't. What if she would have died behind this? You know, and whoever done it, just be, turn yourself in. She didn't deserve this.